Romero Lubambo here for Two Minutes Jazz. I would like to, to talk to you about uh, playing the scale in the whole neck of the guitar. A lot of times uh, we think about one position to play a scale. And when I ask sometimes some student to play, oh, can you play a C major scale, which is, should be easy, they play. <laughs> Or sometimes with two octaves. But I think scales it should be thought as a, the whole thing on the neck. So the C major scale should start here. You have to have this vision that what all the notes of C major scale, where they are. For example, if you're here playing a solo, you have to know that it's here, or here, or here. So one thing that I, I did and I do it when I have some time is, is to play notes just randomly of, the, of any scale. I'm talking about C major, but it should be done for every scale. So for example, I know those notes belong to C major scale. And you should know, because when you're do, doing a solo, a improvisation, you have to know which notes belong to this scale that, that you want to play. Not necessarily in, on top of C major. Maybe you're playing the scale in a D, D minor chord, for example. You still need to know. So practice this as weird as possible in terms of the most weird you can do, the better because your brain is going to you get used to those jumps, you know, and going to get used to see those notes on the neck of the guitar. It's going to help you a lot. Do that for every scale. Thank you very much. Boa sorte com a música.